we, we sent a, a questionnaire out to people when we first started Friends of the Free to ask them what their main concerns were. And I think it was like litter in the river, trash, septic tanks, too many septic tanks on the river, um, trespass was another thing. Because tourism, exa you know, kind of emphasizes all of those things. I mean, the more tourists that come in, of course, the population up there just grows immensely in the summertime when the floaters come. And um, so the river cleanup, we, we knew we could get that together. That was the first project we had. And that has kept on over the years. Every year they have that river cleanup. And then we started doing some education stuff for kids because we figured that that, that would be the best way to reach local people because a lot of local people trash the river too. We thought if we could get some conservation materials to local school kids, and we did that in Lake Inn and Uvalde. Uvalde has, oh, I guess about six or seven schools in its system. Lake Inn just has one. And then we did some Earth Day projects with those two school systems. And also we included Sabinal in that too. And um, we had some real ambitious ideas because there were there are so many things that need to be addressed on rivers, but people don't respond to that multiple, uh, in that, let's see, let's see, multi-attack. They want to focus on one thing. So that's about all they can, if you're a, or if, if you're a volunteer, that's all you have time for. And that's all you can really kind of get people to respond to. So the river cleanup was kind of a natural.